my profile. Search up again with stuff. Watch live while we walk. Thank you, dear. I know Bleeding Universe is conspiring to get me murdered out here. And costed us all. Worst vacation ever. Uh-oh. Alright, it'll load back up in a minute. The enemy appears. Ah, yes. The bug's underfoot. <laughs> that lava fell really quite unsettled by these bugs. <laughs> Sightly buffalo. Fairly, yes. Okay, leave his frail di guidelines. As I expected, you managed the task without too much difficulty. Don't forget to collect your reward. Bonus has been awarded based on speed of completion. See, I knew that was a trial as a waste of time. Plenty of other tasks, such a hardy soul such as yourself could have a little difficulty with. I uh, keep stuttering. Costa de Sol welcomes your continued cooperation. So Lev's unlocked. What did I just get as a reward? Because I thought he got pants. I don't see any pants. to our <sighs> all right time to find the rest of these dancing girls first one nearly got me killed so blessed to be here. This is so beautiful and inspiring, don't you think? I'm feeling so many things. I just need to drink it all in, channel it into my arm. The Hardy Dancer. Oh, honey. I've never seen anything like this. It's all dunes where I come from, you know. I'm sure Master Gagaro won't mind a bit if we stretch our legs before coming to see him. And the Leggy Dancer. Excuse me, who are you? You're not the boss of me. That's right, it's the first time on the beach. You're gonna tell me how long I can and that can't have it, are they? Right, well, give 
me a moment while I try to figure out why this is not accepting that I am streaming. says I'm streaming. I am streaming. Well, <clears throat> make up your mind, game. Overcome by the ocean, are they? Seduced by the sand? With me waiting? Me, who paid so dearly to see their unparalleled undulations. Well, how delightful. They are true artisans. A true artists, as beautiful inside as they are out. Cordenia is green and lies golden, but only cast of the soul is blue and white. Yes, I should have thought of it earlier and given them leave to play upon the beach. Ah, happy it is to be a wealthy man. I shall wait, because well, because I can. I am no gr drudge quaking at the sound of a master's step. Nor am I a knuckle-biter who needs a bottle of brandy wine to keep the tremors at bay. I shall enjoy the anticipation and the fulfillment of life. Southern Thalion, which I believe is near Ulda. close to where I am.
Thank you, friend. With the wasp's gone, it's only a matter of time before the epidemic subsides. Maybe an outsider. But you brought more suckle to my people in a day than I have in many a month. We are humble people. I'm not the means to properly express my gratitude. It may not mean much. But I know always you have a friend in little me amigo. <clears throat> Fried egg or a crumpet. Uh, Some violence going on over there. Mapping the realm, Western Thanakan. Western Thanakan. Thana Take care of this over here then. The 
the blood. Have you brought it? Here you are. Ah, uh, yes, yes, this will serve nicely. By virtue of your toll, I'm one step closer to publishing the many breaths of Thanalan. This is recompense now, though, and may the traitor smile upon you. Monies, thank you. Welcome to the Thermaturge's Guild. It's my faith that guided your steps here, friend. Within these hallowed halls, the arts of devastation are taught, primeval magics, which will bring about the enemy's ruin. If you join our ranks and wield the power of thermaturgy, I urge you to seize this moment to confide in me your arcane ambitions. No, even now is most unsettling. Ah, but the stars are not yet aligned. Your time will come, and I shall be waiting. Soon you'll show them. You'll show them all. Bwah ha ha ha. Establishment and uh, well, do some thingies. Is that painted Mesa? Looking for painted Mesa? You found him. So you're the adventurers volunteered to deal with a mess down at Copper Bell, have you? You've got guts, mate. So if you got the skills to go with them, because things aren't pretty down there. The head of keys left the place in a right state, and nearly a week after mine resumed. I don't know if you know this, but Copperbell was old when the second Ul Dynasty was still young. It was abandoned centuries ago. Hadn't been for the shortage of materials needed for the rebuilding effort, the concern would have thought to, uh, would never have thought to reopen it. Never have thought to reopen it. We knew full well of the giants beforehand, but the project went ahead anyway. I mean, nothing could possibly survive being buried under a mountain's worth of rock for three centuries, right? Huh, <laughs> wrong. Our miners dug up more than they bargained for. One swing of the pickaxe went too many, and they found themselves in the company of giants. Unless we can subdue of the nation's glorious recovery, I'll grind to a halt, for want of aught to build with. Storm torches keep in watch over the entrance in case the giants fancy some sunlight and fresh air. One of them will be able to show you the way in. I hope the nation's resting on you, friend. Best of luck. readjusting. <laughs> One piece, are you? It's about bloody time. I admit, we looked at, we looked as though you just picked up a sword yesterday, but I handled yourself well enough, and I'll give you that. And now I'll give you this as well. Ain't worth a night in Old Oz's finest pillow house, but I'm sure you'll find a use for it.
Just fighting cactuses. Classes, pugilist weapons skills are used to cycle three unique battle forms could dictate the flow of weapon skill combos. Many pugilist weapon skills will either change your form and execution or require you to be in a certain form to execute. Also, weapon skills, which can grant damage bonuses when executed with a certain form. Three types are Raptor, Curl, and Opa Opo. By successfully changing your form for Opa Opo to Raptor to Curl, precisely in that order, you'll be granted an increase to attack potency as well as additional effects based on the weapon skills executed. Swiftly flowing from one form to the next in situation demands a key and becoming proficient at the art of the monk. What's up, Oswald? No rain, nor heat, nor gloom of night. I need your help locating this place shipment. Time to spare, don't you? Make yourself useful. Help me find the missing crates. Manifest clearly states three plates bound for the East Alnanard Trading Company were included in the latest shipment of Desfer Bay. I can't seem to find the bloody things. I ought to be around here somewhere, but I can't waste any more time looking. You find the crates, and then you'll bring them to me. Here goes right, furiously ransacking his cargo at Scorpion Cro Crossing, looking for all the world like a man who's misplaced something. No, 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 no. This can't be happening. There's no time to send for more. No. Ah, you there. Please, you must help me. Go, kill as many cactuars as you can to gather four bottles of their blood. I don't care if you have to hunt the little green bastards to extinction. Please, there's no time to explain. Just go. That my little life hangs in the balance. For the love of the gods, hurry, man. Sorry, too busy getting crates. information about his interest wealthy uh, adventurers heard the news about the goblet quality land so desperately coveted to be auctioned off to bidders regardless of origins even adventurers have a right to participate just imagine the entire area could be end up being owned by wealthy foreign ah beg your pardon sir isn't that i dislike adventurers far from it when you consider old Oz still struggling to accommodate countless refugees the idea that this land is being sold for profit is not surprising whatsoever come to think of it well, at least they could do is give preferential treatment to hardworking old Darwins like me. I've been saving for years, just waiting for an opportunity like this to come along. Say, you wouldn't happen to be curious as well, would you? About the goblet. My hands are full here, but if you have a moment to head that way and look into this auction business on my behalf, I'd be ever so grateful. There's bound to be immortal flames represented by the gates of the goblet who can explain what's going on. This wouldn't happen without General Ball's approval. That I'm sure. Scorpion Cross is worried about the condition of her chocobo. <clears throat> you there, yes, you. You're an adventurer, are you not? You travel about the Eorzea, slaying beasts, finding treasure, that sort of thing. I'm in need of help. I must travel the horizon where my cargo awaits, but my chocobo slugger, he won't move an ilm. I've tried to take a closer look, but a vile pair of antenna protruding from his feathers has lost my nerve. I love slugger with all my heart, but bugs, bugs, I cannot do. I feel I have a parasite ladybug gorging itself in his blood. Check him for me, would you? And if you find a ladybug dug in there, somewhere, kill the damn thing. Quick 
Where? Send the hostile person. Slugger says, thank you. You buy health as you buy things as well. I'm sure son of it was a parasite of the ladybug. It must have latched itself somewhere along the road. How the bloody thing managed to stay concealed at that size is a complete mystery. In fact, I'm not even going to question it. I just move on and put all this behind me. If we don't keep our chocobos healthy, cargo won't be able to move from this land. We owe these birds a great debt. I wish more folk would see that. Go crate. There you go, Oswell. Did you find my crates? Great job, friend. These will have the next wagon thanks to you. The shipments never cut, never stop coming, day in and day out. Just keep tracking everything enough to give me migraines. Business is good, true. Well, use is money if you haven't got the time to spend it. I haven't doubted a pipe with friends in weeks. I was holding a letter addressed to someone at the Silver Bazaar. Boxes, crates, barrels, lifting, moving, stacking. There's no end to it. I am tired. So very tired. Say, friend, to a hardworking stranger of kindness, would you? See, this letter safe to Kikapu at the Silver Bazaar. I'd call on her myself, but I haven't the time. I doubt those weary legs could carry me there even if I did. I'd like to send her something nice along with it. Could I trouble you to scrounge up, say, five hammer beak tail feathers? Gods know you can find the beasts around here easy enough. Kikaboo's a dear old friend. She called the Silver Bazaar home. Well, far too long. There has been ill rumors of a place of late. Just make sure she's well. I bowed to the Kakwar before me. in the middle fight for an animal. It's miraculous, really. Here you go. Have some cacor blood. Do you have the cacor blood? All four orders. All four blood bottles. Show me. Whew, you saved my hide, friend. Just stopping to give my cargo a check on the way to Old Odd, saw all my bottles of rind and <laughs> tonic were as empty as Garlean promise. Looks like the lids took off, shook off in transit, and the whole load spilled right out. I refuse to have it said that Gomtrum failed to make good on our delivery. Cactuar blood is supposed to help keep the skin supple. I just use what you've brought to fill the empty bottles. All those lovely Old Odd ladies will be none the wiser. Oh, don't worry about getting found out. Whereas that skin tonic is still a rare find. All the more so that all the more so this far south. I venture none of the old da would even know it from an ampule of their own piss. Cool. Bottled urine. Well, I'm glad I could help. Alright. Time to take out some hammer beaks.
this. Living okay. Tail Feathers and Oswald's Letter to Kickapoo at the Silver Bazaar. Do -do 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 Poo poo, kicky poo poo, kicky poo poo, kicky kicky poo poo, kicky poo poo, kicky kicky poo poo. Oh my, kicky kicky poo poo, kicky kicky poo poo, poo poo poo. And my, kicky kicky poo poo, kicky kicky poo poo. What do we do? Hey, oh, ever will be done. Kicky kicky poo, we will be done. All right, yep, I ruined it already. Keep. Yes. Just registering. Don't even need anything. Just register. That's it. Well, what is it then? Come try to scare me with these poor folks off the land again. Go on, do your worst. I'll not budge a spot, a spot from this point. Hammerbeak tail feathers in a letter. Dear God, this is from Oswo. Have you seen him? Is he well? Dearest Kiki Poo, it's been too long since I wrote you last. Have you fared since? As ever, I'm a slave to my trade, and sadly, it hasn't, been, uh, it hasn't seen fit to take me to or through the Silver Bazaar in some years. I've had it told the scum of the Uda have set their sights on your Silver Bazaar. It seems beyond saving. Really, how long do you mean to linger in that horrid hobble? Remember, some birds aren't just meant to be caged. Spread your wings and soar once more, Kikapoo. Spread my wings and soar by the gods. This, this is by far the most ridiculous leather I've ever read. Hammerbeak tail feathers. The adult does realize he sent me feathers of a flightless bird, doesn't he? Well, Oswald can go bugger himself. I've no intention of stepping one ill from this hovel. What's us soaring from it? It's my hovel. I love it. Kickapoo of Silver Bazaar is having a hard time handling a couple of troublesome laborers. To, you have a warm face for an outsider. Not like one of those curs loitering about the bazaar. Surely you've seen the hammers to the east of here, or at the very least heard of them. Well, a few of their workers decided to drop into us for a little rest and relaxation. But they're no workers. They're, they're nothing but hired muscles sent to threaten the people of Bazaar and harass our shops. And it's not the first time. I dare say a formidable lad such as yourself just might be able to scare them off with a little strongly worded dart. Doubts. What do you say? Fafafono uh, Fafa has the look of a Lalafell dying to be asked if he has any work to offer. Hey there, friend. I'm sure it's, I, I've a sure way into some easy gill, if you're interested. It won't even require you to break a sweat. Well, not much of one. All you need to do is slay enough rusty cubbins to gather four bottles of cubbin grease, and then deliver it to here in the name of Adelard at the hammers. Once you've done the grease, you can use it to keep the hammers running. It should, it couldn't be more simple. I'm surrounded by fools here. They detest the hammers and the new way of life they symbolize. They care only for the successes of the past, but it blinds them to the opportunities of the present. Change isn't coming, friend. It's already here. I call the Silver Bazaar home for now, but I've no lingering affection for the place. I go wherever it is guild to be got. What's up, Rob Worker? Where's Doubt? He was working, I said, piss off. Enough already, I'm leaving, but you tell that bloody kick up here, it's the end of the nothing, you hear? Nothing. Two of them in the shop, I believe. Bah, I was just about to leave anyway. Don't go thinking you had any part of it. Persistent little bastard, ain't you? Fine. I'm on my way, but you tell Kickapoo this ain't over. That's 
one down at the docks. Yeah. Danielle. Danielle, the silver bazaar, requires some very specific materials to fix his father's broken compass. Please, you must help me. It's my father. Well, he ain't dying or anything. He's a fisherman by trade, you see. But he broke his only compass. He hasn't been able to put one up to sea in weeks. The compass is very special. It was crafted by the goldsmiths of Athens Lepardis. Repairing it will require many chunks of magnetite. Some stones can be found near the lighthouse, but the search for is not without its dangers. The area is rife with earth sprites drawn to the magnetism. I'm an early fisherman, son. I have no arm for fighting, nor the stomach. Three chunks of magnetite will serve to mend the compass. Once you find them, please take them to my father, Gafridis. And now he'll be dawdling around the bazaar. Kitty says meow. Yeah, he's saying welcome back. Yes, he is. I missed you. Did you not hurt him? He's not holding his oh. open for you. You silver bazaar folks are annoying as all hells. I'll give you that. Bugger this job. I'm off to find some peace and quiet. Use the power of doubt to make the workers leave. Okay. Back to Bowie. Okay. Kitty loves you, you understand? <laughs> He loves you with his claws. Yes, he does. Oh, they my gone, goodness. Then? All of them? Well, that's a relief. Serves them right for trying to scare honest folk within their homes and their own masters can buy them. The hammers are built to pound the ground here into solid foundation. The plans to turn these tracks into manors and manuses uh, for thousands of wealthy. Same fate awaits the Silver Bazaar. Since the value of the land is set to rise, small wonder some opportunists are trying to drive us all off so he can have it all to himself. Silver Bazaar may not be what he used to. I... More people leave now than come, and I more shops closed than open. But it's my home, and I don't mean to be chased up by some bloody gillionaire craven to send uh, send w common thugs off to do his dirty work. Ah, uh, yes, gentrification. Good times. Steal land from the poor and sell it to the rich. Tale is old as time. Some magnetite. Yeah, that's right. I'm taking your lodestone. Let that be a lesson to you. Don't attack. Stones from up here. Gotta get up there first. Some magnetite. This 
darn stone those poor earth spirits. It is quite remarkable how this game was salvaged. Don't waste your time, mate. Bloody compass done broke on me. I, I'll not be fishing this day, nor the next. More the like. Here, have some magnetite. Magnetite? Then you'll ask that of you, did he? So Dad's to fix up the old compass and back out to sea, is he? Catch a nice haul of fat fish, hmm? I have a vessel that's barely seaworthy. Scarce big enough for me alone. I've no crew, no hands to help with the haul. Bloody day at sea, busting me arse to get a few gill at best. God's days aren't what they used to be. Time was you get scarce countless ships that used to make worth here. Weren't no empty coin purse or stomach in all the bazaar. Small ships ain't got no place at sea no more. Everywhere I go, it's in the shadow of wake or some monstrous trawler or seener. The old ways are done. We're the old fishermen done lost our way. Ain't no fishermen no more. No much of a father, I suppose. Just a broken man with a broken compass and broken dreams. Captain of the Silver Bazaar wishes to reclaim his fishing lure from the goblin muggers who took him. I appreciate what you did, friend. Bringing me magnetite. Give it more thought. I did. Putting, out, putting back out to sea and all. But even with me compass fixed, soon I got me lucky copper lures. Was wayward by some was waylaid by some goblin muggers a few weeks back. Just north and east of here. The even bastard made off with me lures. Dozens, be it all told. Must be felled by some earth sprites to get the magnetite chunks. Am I right? If so, I reckon you could put down a few goblins and bring me back my lures. Suppose I could make do with just a few of them. Just two. A couple of copper cores should serve for now. Yeah, up for helping a broken life back together. Of course. to get the hammers back up and running. What is it? Can't you see I'm busy cleaning the sand clogs from these hammers? God, I'd kill for a few bottles of cobbler grease right now. Here you go. Cobbler grease? The photo must have sent you. Thank the gods for both of you. Before long, these tracks will be covered with the estates of the Dawn Elite, but the ground is still too loose to build upon. The hammers are pounding to make sure it was a solid foundation. Once that's done, you'll see the structure start to rise. The building was planned to stretch even further, to the heart of the Silver Bazaar even. Seems the powers that be are being left with some local resistance. I have some last name Kikipu the rights of the bulk of the land here. Stop into a fort, that one. Bloody thorn on the side. Kill some goblin muggers. Lure from the Goblin Muggers. Really? That was easy. Certainly easier than it should have been. Such is the way when you're level 30 doing level 2 quests. Or level 5 in this case.
Here you go, Galfridus. Ain't, ain't an easy task. I'm asking all the same, friend. Two copper lures to get me back into the sea and put me in Dedler's heart at ease. I'll be damned. Me old copper lures never thought I'd see these buttes again. Bloody hells, them goblin salt is banging them all up. Bah, I ain't gonna be catching no fish with these. Well, that's that. Must be Nald himself telling me to get out of my sea legs. Might be as well a new life waiting out there for me somewheres. Ah, uh, maybe me compass will lead me to it. Born and bred here I was. Ain't never cold no place else home. Times are changing though. Suppose I could set off to sail. Set off me land or some bloody buzzard prospectors and see what else there is for me. Monies. Fuffano. Sitting as Fuffano of the Silver Bar Bazaar in a very agitated state. These goddamn hollers. Where do they think they are? I paid good coin to... Oh, you there. You're one of those task-seeking adventurer types, are you not? Some wares I ordered at the Old Don Merchant arrived, and these bloody worthless haulers just dropped them outside the gate and left. Ain't obliged to bring them no further, the bloody bastard said. Gate to the bazaar, still the bazaar. Order ain't said nothing about home delivery. The gall. Uh, there's three pieces in all. Would you be so good to bring them to me? B bring them to me. Or bring them, whatever. It's accepted. Kikapu searching for someone to help her with the land prospectors who had their sights set on the Silver Bazaar. It's terrible, Peter. Simply terrible. Please, you must help us. You've already done so much for us, I know, but we're in grave danger. Those fiends have drawn up a fake contract of sale and are trying to use it to drive us from the bazaar. You smell that, Kikapu? Sorry. You smell that, Kikapu? It's the smell of inevitability. You knew this day would come. You simply chose to fill the interim with resistance rather than acceptance. Brave. But foolish. Back for more, Kendrick. How many times must I say it seeps to that thick skull of yours? I'll die before I see one elm of this land fall into your hands. Easily arranged, I assure you. Come, Kikipu, listen to reason. You know who we are. You know our deeds. You've no hope in this. Look at this miserable place. A stain on the map. You resist now, but I swear I will lay waste to those shabby tents and broken buildings. And when I'm finished, I guarantee you will thank me for it. You stupid, foolish man, you couldn't be more wrong. We may no longer boast the visitors of Gil of days past, but this is a home to me and many more. Our memories are here, years worth of them, decades even. We sweated together, we dug this well, we laughed and drank together at every festival, and we mourned together with each life the desert took from us. This is Silver Bazaar, this is home. Those memories are, are what make it this place. And I swear to the Twelve above, I'll feed you and whatever masters you serve your own manhood before you let you destroy it. <laughs> Stubborn girl. No matter. The sale is all but concluded. Look about you. Writs of seizure have already been posted. And I'd not think of taking them down if I were you. End this futile fight, Kikapu. There are far more of us. And if you're truly willing to die for this place, we're more than willing to oblige. Peter, please, the writs of seizure. You must tear them down and chase Kendrick from here once and for all. seizure over here. One left, and then I can go to the bathroom. Because, man, I just suddenly needed to go. <laughs> Alright. We've 
tear down the wit wits of seizure. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay. Oh, these frog-sounding things. Oh yeah, I hate these things. Those things are awful. I thought you might be along. Pity. You're too late. The demolitions are already on their way, and every building bearing the writ of seizure will be rubble within the hour. Oh, by the way, your men dropped these. The writs? Well, what have you done? But that means my men. No. No, that's impossible. They may be yours, but I'll be back soon, and with far more fearsome company. You've just made an enemy for life, you fool. I won't be content simply to see the bazaar struck from the maps. No, I will not rest until its name is wiped from every history book on Eorzea. Barbara. What's up, Kikapoo? So Kendrick is gone for now, is he? That'll certainly be the brightest news we've had in a while, though I can't help but wonder about the more fearsome company he threatens to bring. Oh, never had a way with words, bloody paltry things, but I, uh, we would like to thank you, Peter. You've not just saved the Silver Bazaar, you saved me. You saved who I am. I see now I have to maintain a constant vigilance to keep my home from harm, but it's a vigil I welcome. I'll stand up to any threat that comes through that gate. And we'll stand with you. What are you... I saw what you did for us, having Pieter here chase off Kendrick and all. It's true, there ain't much here worth fighting for, but it's home, goddammit. And now, for one, not be ready to give up just yet. Aye, this is home. And if there's nothing left but sand and cracked stone, I say we build something. Right here. Together. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much. And most of all, thank you, Pieter. There are no more fine garments and goldspun and brocade here. No more bustling port with ships full of cargo and ship. But the better days live on in our hearts. We are the Silver Bazaar, and it is us. Our memories, our past, our history. That's what makes this place. So long as we remain, so too does hope. You taught us what it is to defend the home we love. And from now on, we'll do no less for ourselves than you've done for us. I have a final favor to ask you. This letter, I wonder if you'd deliver it to Mamorty for, for me and next time you visit Ulda. She and I have been friends for many years. Let her read my words and she'll be able to give you the reward that I cannot. They sure Biden today, but there's always tomorrow. Aye, there's always tomorrow. Gods, these elves better not have damaged my bags. Well, have you found them yet? Let's see. Yes, yes, and yes. Excellent. Everything is accounted for. These bags contain garments from Sosuk tapestries, though each is flawed in some way. 
You know, not even a minor mistread is enough to turn the most luxurious gown into fodder for the furnaces. Not here, though. Excuse me. So long as the garments bear a famous name, the souls of Silver Bazaar have no qualms for quantity. Times used to be better. Ah, we were never driven to such lows. But guild is harder to come by now, and more so with each passing day. All that's left is this bazaar to overly proud souls with underly developed tastes. Everyone clings to the glories of a golden past, yet none make efforts to reshape the dismal present. I pray this delible bazaar someday sinks beneath the sands that strangle it. The sooner the better. Monies. Joined a faith against your will while on a chocobo. Storm Touch. There's been an incident inside the Copper Bell Mines. We're here to ensure the effects are contained. But for your own safety, I suggest you stay well away from here. What? You're an adventurer who's volunteered to quell the Hedron. I didn't think the Papa Shun would be able to find someone so quickly, if at all. The giants are content to wreak havoc inside the mines for now, but they're only a matter of time before they think to come outside. The sooner you see to them, the better. Make ready as best you can and enter at will. Copper Bell Mines now accessible. New regular duty has been added to the duty finder. <clears throat> so if you would like to join me for this mission, this would be a mission that would require someone with both of our talents. You'll be able to do it by yourself. All right. I've already done it. The Copper Bell Mines? Okay. I'll do it with NPCs then. Is your registration complete? You're not plugging up gas, you're doing something else. 
Yes, I'm, I'm defending this from the Jesus. Oh, okay, sorry, I misunderstood. This will be awarded for first time completion of this game. Shaft 84 of one. Many to rip. Oh, thought maybe there'd be something in here. Guess not. Back to Shaft B1. Definitely should not be crowding all together right now. <laughs> Very easy for them to attack us. Do a lot of damage. All right.
He does his little moan as he lays on the ground. Five time to set. Activate the blasting device. Shot three floors now cleared. Sure sat E one of them.
I can no longer see it. Wait, what? It's a treasure chest. Four strikers. key and the only place you can use it? Sure. The treasure coffin. Ethereal Blast Gorget. I... You have to be one of them. 